Higher Self, 7th of October 2016. By Mike Quincy. Website, Tree of the Golden Light. The time is rapidly approaching when events will move forward as expected. All the necessary arrangements seem to be in place, and await the final checks before the order is given to go ahead with revaluation of the currencies. It has taken a lot of planning to reach this point, plus the cooperation of the many, many people involved. Clearly the wait will have been well worthwhile, and will be seen as the turning point when events have turned the way for those working for the light. There is still confusion as to what is taking place and in part caused by those who are against the changes being introduced. In any event there will be winners and losers but the changes will fully benefit the whole population of Earth. All are to be given the opportunity to reach an acceptable standard of living, and eliminate the unfairness in the distribution of wealth. Where the will of God is concerned nothing can change the outcome regardless of any actions taken by the Illuminati. Their role in opposition to those of the light has caused them to rise up and evolve much quicker than it would otherwise have occurred. It means that many more souls will have reached levels that entitle them to ascend. There is no choosing of such souls, and their success is entirely due to their own efforts to evolve out of the lower vibrations and into the light. It is not a matter of becoming a total light being, but becoming of service to others for the greater part of your life. You can achieve it in so many ways and it is not necessarily confined to those who have a religious background. Equally you can serve others in many ways all according to their needs and it is not necessarily about money, but those who are very wealthy can do great things because of it. In view of present world conditions some see major changes as impossible, but it should be stressed that those of the light that guide humanity are very powerful beings. They can change the vibrations of Earth so that all weapons of war cannot operate. So peace can be enforced, and from a karmic point of view will be seen as justice, to reward those who have kept their light shining forth regardless of the difficulties encountered. When war and the equipment for war become obsolescent, peace and happiness can soon return to Earth. So much more good work can be done when people feel safe and out of harm's way. One of the greatest lessons you can learn on earth is forgiveness which can be extremely hard when you may have been physically harmed. Retaliation is a natural response but if you are to avoid more karma it is best to walk away from such temptations. Bear in mind that if you do not immediately pay for sins committed whilst on earth, you still have to face the consequences. It takes a strong willpower to keep calm in such circumstances but simply tell yourself that every negative action has to be made good at some time. The biblical story of Jesus told of turning the other cheek, and that is symbolic of how you should aim to be. Keep calm and walk away from the temptation to seek revenge. Looking at things from the higher levels of love, sums up what you should all be concentrating upon. Those levels that face you are of more light and it is such that you can use this energy to perform miracles. Universal energy is the panacea, for all ills and as you rise up it should be the principal feature in your life. It is the ultimate energy with which you can perform miracles. Even on earth now it has resulted in some miraculous healing, and that also includes self-healing. It seems so simple to apply such thinking. But particularly on earth you are being bombarded by so many different energies it is sometimes difficult to keep focused on love. The light, upon earth is seeking out the darkness, and filling it with the higher energy. Slowly but surely the changes are becoming significant and grounding the light for all to enjoy. Eventually there will be no lower energies upon earth at all, and the golden age will have truly have commenced. It will be your first experience of total peace upon earth, and it will last until 1000 years have passed, when lower energies will be allowed to mingle with it. By then you will have progressed beyond recognition as beings of light. So all the time and effort you put in to raise your vibrations will be well rewarded, and certainly never regretted. You will notice that governments and their politics are under pressure to change and the general movements are to move away from those who are warmongers. The people have had enough experience of all things associated with wars, 
and a strong desire for world peace is taking root. You still have your so-called hot spots where there seems to be no sign of any way of bringing about peaceful solutions. These are for the working out of karma that needs to be cleared before true peace can be established. At the same time the power game is still being played out, but you will eventually see that events turn out to be most acceptable by keeping the drive for power over the people at bay. Knowing that major changes are around the corner seems to hold people back, but the advice is to carry on as before and respond to the changes when they place. There is not any real gain by first waiting to see what happens, as in the long run all will benefit from them according to their needs. It may take a little time to get round to everyone, but have no fear as no one will be missed out. Bear in mind that the assistance that is being given to you through your galactic friends will continue, and so ensure that matters progress at all speed. As new inventions are also passed on to you, life will quickly take on a new look and allow you much more time to attend to your own needs. Be assured that all matters have been well covered by the plans that have already been made to ensure your quick advancement into the new age. Keep on your path of light and do not let anything distract you from your intentions. There are still groups that only have self-interest in mind and would stop at nothing to advance at others' expense. However, their success will be short-lived and their efforts will ultimately lead to disappointment. They are already struggling to maintain their positions of power and sooner or later will be stopped in their tracks. The higher powers know all that is happening and there is no hiding place for them. They have much to account for, and will learn their lessons as all souls have to when they stray from the path of light. By being present in duality all souls learn by experience, and see firsthand what happens when their vibrations are lowered and they have less contact with the light. I leave you with love and blessings, and may the light brighten your days and path to completion. This message comes through my higher self. In love and light. Mike Quincy